All right, adventurers, welcome back to All Play. We're here with more of the Pokemon Soul Silver Nuzlocke. I got gas. Okay, so we were about to get ready to go do the Pokemon League, but we got a notification from Professor Elm saying that the Kimono Girls were actually looking for us, so we need to head to Ecruteague City before we go to the League, okay? So we're going to take a very quick trip over there using our flying scavenger. Here we go. All right. So here in Ecruteague City, there is a dance theater. If you remember, we came to the dance theater and we helped one of the Kimono Girls. I didn't realize smells went up a level. Uh, we helped one of the Kimono Girls. Oh, sweet baby Jesus. Why does this always happen? And why does that one person look like Snoopy? <sighs> All right, that's better. I'm I'm looking a little bit more healthy there. Okay, uh, we helped one of the dance, one of the girls in the dance theater, and they want us to return here for one reason or another. Oh, sweet baby Jesus! How how is this possible? That's not his voice, is it? How is this possible? How could I lose to a mere kimono girls? You were watching me chill. Yeah, that's right. I never thought defeating five kimono girls would be so hard. I got beaten to a pulp. You must have come here for the same reason, right? Don't get cocky just because you defeated Team Rocket. Those Camilla girls are insanely strong. Go ahead, see if you can defeat them. But I'm not going back. I don't want to see you win. So he has faith that we can do it. He believes we can do it. All right, so the Kimono girls, I'm gonna go ahead and break it down for you guys. Or they're gonna break it down. There's five of them. We met five of them over the course of this adventure, and they're actually all different girls. Welcome. My name is Zuki. I met you previously in Violet City. She's the one that we helped with, um, I'm sorry. She was lost in the, in the, what's it, what forest is that? Alex Forest? The forest just outside of Azalea, Azalea, or uh, Violet City. Um, we helped her find her way, or more, Perry helped her find her way. In order to bring back Lugia, we needed someone with the right bond with Pokemon. We asked Mr. Pokemon to give this mystery egg to whoever showed true potential. The egg was eventually handed from Mr. Pokemon to Professor Elm, then to you. However, being pure alone will not be sufficient to face the power of this Pokemon. I must test you. Are you ready? Um, we're going to have to get into five battles. Not just five battles, but five back to back. We don't get to do anything between each battle. So once we start the first one, we don't get to leave here or heal up at all. Until we do the fifth one. Uh, until we succeed at the fifth one. And because it's a Nuzlocke, if we lose against any of them, we lose for real. Here we go. I will test how closely you've bonded with your Pokemon. Alright, so up front for each of these battles, we'll have Perry. Perry will show our true bond for each of these fights. Here's Electrode. Guess who's getting pulled the f*** out? <laughs> Perry, how many clicks? We need Scav in. The only problem is Scav's probably not going to be... Scav's going to be strong enough, but in the event that there's a self-destruct, we will lose Scavenger. Here's Dawn. I'm putting Dawn in because I feel like Dawn can muscle through. I feel like Dawn can muscle through on this electrode. Here's a light screen. No pun intended, by the way. Didn't mean that to be a joke. When I, when I say all Dawn, no dusk, I mean that. Dawn muscling through? No, that's that's... Unclassy. Here's a charge beam. Come on. Oh, good. You you got this, Dawn. I'm here for it. Here's a force palm. Yeah, that's pretty damn good. Another charge beam. It's all right. Oh, it's going to be stronger, actually, because the special attack went up on the last one. Come on. It's all right. You got this. You got this, Dawn. Muscle through. Muscle through. Now, I hope we don't have to use Dawn again. Oh, we don't have to switch out to Dawn. Because remember, we're doing five battles, one Pokemon each. Uh, this is the first. Perry leveled up. Perry ain't do nothing. Perry leveled up. <laughs> I don't have any Pokemon left. All right, so that's one down. Oh, normally, these trainers have all the EV evolutions. Uh, um, I'm sorry, for the first two generations. So Vaporeon, Jolteon, Flareon, and then Espeon and Umbreon. Uh, they'll have five random Pokemon that are among the same same skill level, I guess. Same relativity. Uh, you are quite strong. You helped me in the Ilex Forest. So this is the one that we helped 
and Alex Forrest. What was it, Violet City? What was the other one in Violet City? I don't remember. I don't remember. I'll go back and watch. My name is Naoko. I'm the one that's not so good with directions. My eyes witnessed you defeating Team Rocket when Kurt was in trouble at the Slowpoke Well. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. All right, here we go. Come on, Perry. I hope you can. I hope you can shine bright here, Perry. Huntail. Eh. You're not at a disadvantage, but your moves aren't strong here either. I'm sorry, Perry. Here's Victoria. Here's Victoria. Huntail is a water type. This is all Victoria, as a matter of fact. Oh, I used dive. Okay, I'm about to say, did it fly? Is that what happened? We're going to use growth. I know we're faster. I know we're faster than Huntail. We're going to use growth. Dive. It's a water type attack, which means it's not going to do too much. Growth should make Razor Leaf kill this in one shot. This should be a one shot here. If it's a crit, it's definitely a one shot. Ooh, that crit though! I don't know how I knew it, but I knew that was a crit. All right, two down. Oh, you are truly strong. Two down. You are quite the trainer. I remember you chasing off that Team Rocket grunt from right here. So she's the one that was here in the dance, center, uh, dance theater. I must thank you for that. Although, I am actually a trainer myself. She who knows the most speaks the least. I am Miki, the kimono girl. Allow me to challenge you in your Pokemon. All right, who she got? Who's on her team? All right, Miki. A Hariyama. We need to switch. Problem is, we don't have anyone with an advantage over Hariyama except for Echo. Except uh, Scavenger, but we really can't send Scav out. Here's Echo. Echo, I hope you're up for it. We haven't seen you in a while, buddy. I want to know when Echo evolves. I would love to know how Echo evolves. Let's say that. Belly Drum. It dropped its health to half to increase what? Attack all the way? Yeah. Attacks all the way up. Scav, you have... I'm sorry. Echo, you have to do this. Here's the confusion. Yes. Oh! Oh, no! Smelling salt. Hold it. It's not paralyzed, so it shouldn't kill. Damn! We lost Echo, and I wanted to know when Echo evolved. I feel like our friendship was there, man. Oh, no. Okay, we need someone fast. Victoria, I think you should be faster. You should be faster than a Hariyama. Let's see. Let's look at our Hariyama. Because it's not specific. It's not, a, uh, it's not potentially fast. So 55, yeah, you should be way stronger, um, Victoria. Uh, way faster. Come on. Uh, come on. Come on, Victoria. Yes. Damn it, man. We lost. We lost Echo. Now I'm really sad. Now I'm really sad. Oh, man. Why do we keep losing our babies? Why do we keep losing the babies? Also, when does Echo evolve? When does Tingling evolve? Oh, you're good at Pokemon, too. When does, when does Tingling evolve? I could have swore it was by friendship. I could have swore it was supposed to evolve by now. Excellent fighting spirit. You got me off the ice by pushing me from the back. I am the one who skates in sandals. I am Seyo, the kimono girl. I was listening in the Dragon's Den when you passed the test of the Elder. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. Alright, here we go. I'm, kind, I'm honestly kind of down. I'm kind of down now that we lost Echo. Hypno. Of course. Of course, there's a Hypno. There's a Hypno here. Here's, a, here's an Aqua Jet. You hold this Aqua Jet for me. Come on. Oh, damn. We need to get it together. If this is all we're doing, we need to get it together. That's not on Perry. That's on the entire team. Because Perry's supposed to be our boy. A headbutt. It's not going to do. We're steel type. We're steel type. It's not going to do the numbers. Here we go. All right. And that makes four. That makes four. All right. Oh, so close. I almost had you. 
Miki had a better shot. Miki was actually pretty strong. Here's our last one. I am the last one. That was weird. <laughs> that was weird. I am the last one. You were so dependable at the Goldenrod Tunnel. I am the one who twirls even underground. I am Cooney, the kimono girl. I looked at you and wonder when you thwarted Team Rocket's mission to take over the radio tower. You must show your strength to me now. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. All right. Go ahead. You, can, you get this challenge on. Fine. Lapras. Her last was Lapras. Note. Perry had no advantage over any, over any of the Kimono Girls Pokemon. I think we would have been in an even worse state had we a different starter. We would have been in an even worse state. Rain Dance. Uh-oh. It's Rain Dance. Is it setting up? Is it setting up? All right, Victoria. Here comes the Razor Leaf. Here's a Razor Leaf. Oh, not even halfway. It's Paris Song. Why would it use Paris Song if it's their only Pokemon? Let's see if we can kill it. The way Paris Song works, it counts down. Uh, all the Pokemon that hear the Paris Song count down. Uh, from three, I should say. They count down from three. Once they get to zero, I'm sorry, they count down each turn by one, starting from three. Once they get to zero, if they've heard the Paris song, they are dead. They die completely. No matter how much health they have, no matter anything else, they die. Um, what you have to do is you have to switch them out before they get to zero. Oh, sweet lord, Ice Beam. Come on. Come on, Victoria. All right. Uh, you have to switch them out so that they don't hear the Paris song. Also, if it's a Pokemon that can't hear, they have um, Soundproof as their ability, they won't hear the Parasong. They won't hear it. Um, I'm scared Victoria's going to miss. Here's a strength. Okay. So if, let's say, let's say I switched out Victoria and I just didn't worry about damage at all. Eventually her Lapras, um, the, the Kimono Girl's Lapras would have died because it heard its own Parasong. And she had no way to switch to anybody else. You are wonderful. That's all five. We were not wrong about you. You are indeed worthy of this. Please take it. We got the title bell. If you guys remember when we went to, I'm sorry, when we saved the, the radio tower, the director gave us, he gave us the clear wing, right? I think he gave us the clear wing. And he mentioned another item that we need to be able to witness Lugia, which is this legendary Pokemon within the Johto region. Uh, the title bell is the other item that we need. Uh-oh. Big sisters! I just saw this big shadow of a Pokemon in the World Island's waters. It could, it could be... Chill. We'll be at the World Islands. See you there. Alright, so they all gonna book. They're just gonna leave me. They're not even gonna tell me how to get to the World Islands. Oh, it's Lyra. Let's talk to her. She always has important stuff to say. Hello, this is Lyra. How are you? I was walking along with Meryl by my side when I turned to look at it and saw it evolving into a Zoomerill. I was so surprised. I didn't think something like that would happen. Well, I'll talk to you later, chill. That's the important thing. Yeah, I thought I, I genuinely thought this was something important. Okay. So what we're going to do now is we're going to leave the Critique Dance Theater. And we need to get to the World Islands. I don't know if you guys know this, but the World Islands is an area that we bypassed before. I mentioned that there were whirlpools when we had to go from Olivine City. Remember when Amphi was sick and Jasmine, the Pokemon gym, I'm sorry, the gym leader at Olivine City, um, wanted us to go across the waters towards Cyanwood City to get some medicine for Amphi. If you guys remember, there were some islands that we, I'm sorry, there were some whirlpools that we bypassed because we couldn't access them just yet. There were whirlpools that were protecting the world islands. They don't want anyone not strong enough to handle the Pokemon in the world islands to go near it. Luckily, there's whirlpools there. But now we are strong enough to actually go in the world islands and be able to encounter the legendary Pokemon there. We're going to need to stock up on a lot of super repels because I do want to know. I, if, if the legendary Pokemon is a legendary, I want to catch the legendary. I don't want to catch anything else. 
Here's the downside, guys. I don't know. I've never, I've never, ever been in the World Islands. Not in Gen. Oh, this is the map, not the, not Scavenger's Fly menu. Oh, we gotta, we gotta put Echo to rest. So we're gonna replace Echo with somebody. I've never, ever been in the World Islands. Uh, let's see. We need to get uh, Repel, so we're actually gonna go to Olivine City. I've never, ever done the World Islands, so I have no idea what it looks like on the inside. When I say this is an adventure, I mean this here will be an adventure. We're going to stock up on items and do a little bit of training before we go into the World Islands. But be ready for that, guys. This is going to be interesting. Yeah, I have no idea what to expect in there. I don't know if there's just Pokemon. I don't know if there's trainers. I don't know if there's puzzles. Any of that. So we're going to call it here, all right? Actually, we're going to go inside. I'm going to put Echo in the box. And then next time we'll we'll have a new member on the team. All right. If you guys enjoyed this episode of the Pokemon Soul Silver Nuzlocke playthrough, and would love to see more. Then all you have to do, all you have to do, is hit that red button below this video. On last, that subscribe button, and I'll do my best, do my best to make sure you guys can see more episodes of games like Pokemon Soul Silver, more challenges like the Nuzlocke run, as well as everything else that Alt Play has to offer. Thank you guys for checking this out, and I'll catch you later with more here on Alt Play. It's going to be fun. It's going to be fun for sure.